So we have the N2600 series from SVSI. It is a 4K60 444. Uh, platform supports HDR10+. Plus. Uh, we have it available in a box and a card version, as well as in a, a wall plate form factor. We have a wall plate encoder, and now for the first time, a wall plate decoder. Uh, the wall plate form factors are available in both a US Decora style and an EU UK de Decora style. Um, the, the wall plates are, are interesting because for the first time, we no longer have a, a skew specific for the color, for black or for white. We're now doing one skew with both a white and a black faceplate uh, within them to make it easy for them to be installed in the field, you know, in case a customer changes their mind or availability is something like that where it needs to be switched. The box versions along with the card is the S model. And the, the highlight there is, is that it has a simultaneous dual codec uh, capability and what that is is that is the ability for the generation of the 4k 60 uh, high quality stream as well as a simultaneous h264 stream and the reason for that is is that for education with trying to do lecture capture such as panopto or facebook or youtube as well as with corporate and government where they need to transmit a large amount of data at a, at a very small rate across the network or you know to other buildings or campuses you know around the world things like that uh, both of the box and the encoders support full bandwidth usb 2.0 so 480 meg full bandwidth and that's from the decoder to the encoder the wall plates have a usb c input and what that is is that's not only audio but also video audio and the USB. So that's a single connection that'll get you all three. No longer need to do multiple cables there at the table. The box versions have a dual HDMI input, whereas the wall plates, like I said, have a USB-C and an HDMI. The USB-C doesn't supply power, um, but it is available with those other connectivities. And then the same suite of tools that have been known for SVSI from Enable to Enact to the end command platform are all used to manage and support uh, the, the product, as well as with an open yeah. control yeah, API yeah. that you can use with the AMX or third-party control systems uh, at that point.